Orale. Welcome back to another episode of Hogwarts Legacy. My name is Ragu, and you're tuning in to the life of Pablo Potter, man. Alright, so uh, today we're going to go ahead over and talk to the boy Deke the Freak, see what he wants. First, let's take off on our, on our cool little boy over here, Cal Calico. Oh my god, it's dope just taking off on these things. Flying, soaring at the speed of light. Yee yee yee! Hell yeah. All right, let's go talk to the boy Deke the Freak. Not because he's freaky looking, because he's freaky. He's freaky with the ladies. He's freaky with the lady goblins, you know? I caught myself a unicorn. How's my boy? How's my boy doing? My boy Uni. Yeah. Yeah, my boy Unicorn. Can I name you, bro? I can. Whoa, dude, look at him. What do we name a beautiful creature like this? I'm going to name the boy Mehmed. Yo, Mehmed the second. After the uh, the great conqueror himself, yo, the man, the first man to take down Constantinople. Fun little fact: twenty-three men tried, but Mehmed was the first to succeed. He launched the great Ottoman Empire, and now he's our horse. I think it's a lady horse, but fuck it. Mehmed the second, there she is. Yo, can I ride you? That's my question. Moonkoff. Oh, you guys want your brush too, huh? There you go. It's collecting. Nice little quick visit to our animals. Nothing much. And we're back in our room. Wow. Well, or... Deke would like to talk with you when you have a moment. I know, Deke. That's why we're here. Gosh, Deke. Get out of my room, Deke. Gosh. Chill out, my boy. I gotta weave some shit now. Mm, my boy, where's my cap? Nasal fair. Boom. Gosh, Deke. Get out of my room. Deke would like to talk with you when you have a moment. Just like, oh, he's him up in my business, Deke. Gosh. It's all right, though, Deke. You're like family, man. Okay, what you want, Deke? Hello, Deke. Professor Weasley said you wanted to tell me more about the loom. Ah, hello. Uh, yes, about that. Deke has had a thought. He... <laughs> okay, well, this place just keeps expanding and expanding. What am I, Cinderella, bro? What is this? What is that area? Oh! Oh, seems the room thinks you need more space for your beasts. I do. Uh, as Deke was saying, uh, he's had a thought. Now, Deke knows how you can test the item of clothing that you enhanced in the enchanted loom. And uh, perhaps help an old friend in the process. What do you mean? A house elf named Tobbs works for his master, retrieving leech juice in a cave near Hogwarts. Tobbs' master doesn't let him leave the cave. And Deke knows the cave is infested with spiders. That sounds awful. Gross. It is. Deke hasn't heard from his friend for a while now. As the item you wove in the loom has an enchantment that might be useful, Deke thought you could test it whilst checking on Tobbs. I'll find Tobbs. I understand. Leave it to me, Deke. I'll find Tobbs for you. Oh, thank you. Please let Deke know what you learn about Deke's old friend. I got you, Deke boy. First, what the hell is this? What the fuck, man? Beast that can be rescued in the Highlands. Point the cave. What the fuck? What the actual fuck's going on? Oh gosh. Beast items. Okay. I'll put the niffler down. Okay, can I collect something off my boy? A hippogriff feather! What the fuck? What the hell is wrong with my niffler here? Come on, buddy, eat some food. You gotta eat too, man. Can I collect anything from you? A thestral hair? That's a boy, Niffly. Niffler hair? This guy keeps howling. Is he not happy? Or is that just the noise he makes? I don't know. But my hippogriff looks like he's trying to take off. Well, it's his life. We added a new uh, area to our vivarium, I assume. That's uh, nutty. Okay, we get, let's go help Deke out. Let's go help the boy Deke the Freak out. On another adventure, are we? Yes, we are. Thought we'd forget about that goblin helm, you nick. Mm, sorry, buddy. Not looking for you. This must be Tobbs' cave. Defender, arrest the momentum. Come on, buddy. What do you got? What do you got? What do you got? Oh, God. Confinder. Oh, God. Come on, man. What you got? Arrest the momentum. Come on. Defender. Confinder. Yeah. Okay. Here we go. Defender. Look. Lion. A little cringe, but uh, F it, man. It'll work for now. Gonna go into the spider den. Spider's. Oh, Spinner's Cavern. Nice. It's definitely gonna be infested out here, man. Oh, God. Uh -oh. Incendium. Just finish that boy right out the gate. So we won't have to There's see his ass. Tobbs? Tobbs? Deke sent me. Are you in here? Uh oh. Come on, Tobbs. Uh, you gotta be kidding me. 
Out here. Confringo. Burn that shit. Quick little chest. Oh my god. Get out of there. Another spiderous web. Let me go. Oh no. Expelliarmus, come on. Accio. Oh god. Let me go. Hold up, buddy. Accio. Incendio. Come on. Let me go. Expelliarmus. Oh my god, these little spiders are everywhere, bro. Is there another one here? Revelio. Make me thinking there's fucking creatures everywhere, man. Oh god, these little gross little things, man. Are those things dead already? Yeah, there we go. Dirty little spider. Some more clones. Oh god! Oh god, that was a big ass fucking spider, bro. Oh gosh. Look over this fucking wall right here, bro. What the hell? It looks as if Tops was here some time ago. He must have headed deeper into the cave. Confringo! God damn. Glacier! The pulsar! Get back! Confringo! Okay, okay, okay. Oh. Get out of here, man. Stomp on him real quick. Depulsa. Confringo. Keep blasting him. Rependo. Come on. Arresto momentum. Keep going. Keep going back. Confringo. Confringo. These little spiders think they're slick, bro. Oh my god. Ugh. Gross little things. Not my fault you're a deadly great spider. Oh, Confringo. So many little spider webs and nooks and crannies, bro. But you know, we gotta loot. We always have to loot. Confringo. Oh, got almost fell off the edge there. We're about to fight that big spider thing, aren't we? Confringo. Oh, I thought that was a, <laughs> thought it was a spider sack. Oh, gosh. Where? Dude, there's little spiders. Incendio. In case. Just in case. The long, ominous, spidery hallway. Oh god, we're about to get ready for a big fight, boys. Let's prepare ourselves! Oh yeah, tunnel into the fucking yep, space there. Let's go. Uh, uh, Who am I fucking shooting first? Confringo. Boom! Come on, make sure you are Come on, beat him! Incendio. Is that it? Well, that didn't sound particularly reassuring. The matriarch definitely fell down there. I don't know if that was a spider we we're gonna be uh, gonna start creeping about. Maybe. Did we get something from breaking these rocks? Cause I always see them stacked up there. Incendio. Okay. That's too creepy. Oh gosh. Fuck if it's creepy, bro. Okay. One spider. Ooh, that's a little fuckers too. It just sounds like we s signaled a fucking. Oh God. I don't know what that did. Nope. Yep. Here it is. Here's that motherfucker. Uh, oh God. Oh God. Yep. Supervised. God, come on! Stick to fly, you bastards! Come on! What do you got? That all you got? Strike him down! Ah! Oh, lightning smash! Go! Yo! The bastards! Oh, okay! Oh, he hit me! Oh, God! Come on! Go! Come on! What all you got? Come on! You little bastards, come on! Incendio! Oh god, I missed! No, get out of here! Oh! Freeze! Boom! Oh 
Oh god. Oh god. Where's he coming? Where's he coming? Where's he coming? Is he still here? Oh, he just went back further into the cave. What a puss. What a puss. Good finger. You didn't want all the smoke, huh? Okay, well, it's clear we're gonna have to go deeper down this cave. And I'm assuming it's gonna be this way. Come on! Get on your gut! You chump! You chump! Oh! Oh, God! Come on! Oh, God! Oh! Oh, God! Oh, God! Is he dead? Oh, gosh! Eight legs is simply too many. Oh, I really jumped in that motherfucker like that. I really was like that. I'm that man. I got in close. That is not good. We should never get that close again. What? How are there still more of you? I just killed your papa! I hope that was your papa or mama, whatever you little nasty things are. Did I just come through that cave? Which way did I just... Which way did I just come from, bro? I'm lost. I feel like I've been down this path. Yeah, if I shot across that fool over here, then I knocked some fucking rocks over it. God damn it. I locked the man where I came from. To a scary for no reason. Did I come from here? Where did I come from? Okay, okay, let's see what we got here. Tobes! Oh no. I have a feeling that house elf is Tobbs. No. Poor Tobbs. Tobbs. Left here alone with the spiders. Tobbs, fuck your old master Tobbs, man. Oh no, poor guy. Oh god, poor Tobby. Okay, well, sorry Deke, your friend died. Did kill that spider though. Nice. That table looks familiar. Seems I'm back at the entrance to the cave. I had to go back real quick, make sure I got all the loot we know. <laughs> okay, okay, hustling through here. All right, let's go tell Deke about his friend, sadly. You know, he didn't make it. Uh, let me uh, walk by real quickly and awkwardly. Hey, Deke. I'm back from the cave, Deke. Wonderful. Uh, uh, Deke hopes you gave Deke's best to Tobbs. I'm sorry to tell you this, Deke, but Tobbs is gone. It seems he was unable to avoid the spiders in the end. Oh, my. Deke was afraid of this, alone in that cave for so long. Oh, poor Tobbs. Uh, Deacon Tobbs once shared the same master. When he died, uh, we were separated. Deke always wished Tobbs had been sent to Hogwarts too. Deke feels lucky to serve such kind witches and wizards like you. Deke will miss his friend dearly and will raise a glass to him with a heavy heart. <laughs> poor Deke, the homie man. I'm truly sorry about your friend, Deke. Thank you. You are very kind. Deke could use some time alone to think, if that's all right. Poor man. Torn apart. Actually, let's grab some beasts. Probably have to sell some of these for wolves anyways. Move to inventory. Professor Howen will never believe this. Don't worry, little guys. Quick little fast travel. Very useful. Except you gotta hear that lady every time. I always say that travel brought it to mind. I bet you do. Oh my gosh. Hello. Mind you, don't turn quick. If you're stuck with a Dory Call Feather. Hello. Oh, welcome to Brood and Peck. I'm Ellie Peck. And before you ask, I'm out of a Braxton hair. The lot of it was bought up by a trader in Ottery St. Catchpole. Made me take it in person, they did. No care that I had to shut the shop. Apparently, had a bad experience with someone shipping them hair for my Wampus Cat. Must have been someone from America, no doubt. Because we don't even have a Mia. Anyway, what are you here for? Moon car fur? Derricall feathers? Always have trouble collecting them myself as the bird keeps disappearing. Cheeky thing. <laughs> Used to carry them in the shop, Derricalls. But people kept asking for their money back when they'd get home and the blasted things would be nowhere in sight. <laughs> what they, they expect, man? I can imagine that would be rather frustrating. There's worse. Trust me. Most of the suppliers of whopper feathers may as well be living in St. Mungo's. Not surprising, I suppose. The choir knows things. Oh, but such marvellous feathers. <laughs> Almost worth going mad for. True that. Sounds like stocking your shelves comes with some hazards. Truer words never spoken. Used to carry beasts themselves. Good business it was, but add it up to ear with parents grumbling. Not my fault if the little ones caught a flea of an easel. 
You should have heard them. No. <laughs> Best with byproducts. And I do like to make sure the beasts are safe and well cared for. Couldn't guarantee that with some of these prospective owners. Now, why don't you have a good look around? Stocks change all the time, and not just because they disappear. Always best to pop in whenever you can to get things before they run out. <laughs> Which they used to literally do. <laughs> okay, quite a personality you, on, this, on this Take merchant. Take all the time you need. And thank you for stopping by. A treat to have you here. All right, let's see, let's see what you got. Now, what sorts of beast byproducts might you be looking to acquire? I'm looking to sell, sell beast. I don't mind selling things for certain clients. You know where to find me. Unicorn hair, I have this. Ooh, that's actually a lot, 700. I'll not mind seeing you here again. Consider yourself welcome. Okay, ooh, a fooper. Can I? There's no way. Oh, this beast cannot be rescued. <laughs> okay, well, that's that's my dummy fault for just trying to hijack it here from the store and run. All right, all right. What the fuck? I told you not to go down that path. Miss Peck from Rude and Peck said a customer lost a deeracle around here. I know we're not supposed to go down there. I just thought... You could have got us in a lot of trouble. I'm very sorry, Father. Only she said I might earn a reward. Uh, instead, I just wasted our time. There you are! Ha! Huh, finally! I'll have enough for that wind wisp. Ah, well, not meant to be. Also, I may have knocked over a dustbin back there. Never mind, I'll fix it, as always. <laughs> Sometimes it seems all roads. Accio! Little humble, little humble moment between uh, father and son. Oh, I'm trying to get into here. My good sir. No touching if you have sticky fingers. Okay. Ooh. I'm now demi guys. A demi guys in the flesh. Rebellion. Oh. Ah, uh, you ain't gonna see me this time, buddy. Please refrain from touching. I don't want to touch your stuff, buddy. Action. All right, well, I think that's going to conclude today's episode, guys. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. And if you did, uh, leave a like, comment, possibly subscribe.